Joe, uh, since you are, uh, you're, you're a great actor and you're quick on your feet, I thought it would be fun if we put your movie knowledge to the test. It is time for A to Z. Here we go. A to Z. A to Z. Now, here's how it'll work. You and I are going to have a conversation about our favorite movies, but the catch is that each time one of us brings up a new one, the title has to start with the next letter of the alphabet. We'll go back and forth and see if we can get all the way from A to Z. Are you ready for this? It's the, it's the English alphabet, right? <laughs> yeah. Well, tonight we're using the English alphabet. That's correct. Uh, I'll start off the conversation, and then you'll, you'll start with the letter A in your first movie. Uh, Joel, it, this summer, hmm. uh, blockbusters, giant movies coming out this summer. Uh, people are getting back into theaters. Uh, what are you excited yeah. to, to see, or what do you remember your first blockbuster that you, that you oh, enjoyed? Oh, I'm very excited to see Almost Famous 2. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a great. I uh, love the first one. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the manager in that was incredible. <laughs> yeah, he really was amazing. Deserved an award. Thank you very much. Yeah. Uh, I'm looking forward to the reboot of, uh, of Bad News Bears just to see if I can watch. I mean, because I'm a big fan of the old ones. Uh, I get, I get that. Do you ever, Jimmy? I know that you know, like New York gets hot in the summer. Do you ever just want to get away to like a cold comfort farm? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> you ever seen Diner with uh, Mickey Rourke? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've seen it. It's great. Uh, Tim Daly is in that as well. Uh, boy, that answer just went every which way but loose. Yeah, uh, yeah I, so I almost belong on a funny farm. <laughs> I, boy, wouldn't that be a great Muppet caper? <laughs> uh, I remember Great Muppet Caper. I used to watch it was double features on that and Harry and the Hendersons and the same thing. It was great. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, and the thing about Harry is that he was, uh, you know, real. It wasn't a puppet. Everyone knows that Sasquatch is real. But a lot of people, when I get into that conversation, we just have irreconcilable differences. Yeah. But do you ever see the documentary about the real dinosaurs? The theme park uh, with like real dinosaurs in it is a documentary. Oh yeah, uh, Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> no. No, it's uh, Jurassic Park. It was what it was called. It's a great documentary. You know, I don't know that, and it's just nice to be with you, Jimmy, because you are a real king of comedy. Thank you very much, because I, I thought what we had was lost in translation, but. It... Oh. I didn't think, because I, I don't think it's lost at all. I just know that M is for murder. I, I want to tell you something, and this is just between us. I've, mm. I've, I've never been kissed. Oh, you should go to Orlando. You sure? <laughs> you sure? I swear you should go. To Orlando, you old boy. Oh, okay. Yep. Uh, uh, okay, well, whatever. I hope you find some office space. Uh, oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah, thank you. Uh, yeah, I will because. Those are all movies. No, I'm sorry. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. Uh, you know what I always think is funny? I don't know if to say uh, uh, Pirates of the Caribbean or Pirates of the Caribbean. Isn't that, isn't that weird? Uh, I think it's Caribbeani. Uh, it's a very, it's an unknown pronunciation. But anyway, this one's hard. Yeah. Uh, okay, if I say the, the phrase, we are the mods, we are the mods, we are, we are, we are the mods, do you know what I'm talking about? Yes, yes, yes. You're talking about uh, the, the band, Repeat Townsend, Roger Daltrey. Quadrophenia That's correct. is the movie. Quadrophenia is a good movie, yes. It was almost okay. as good as Roadhouse, but... Uh... It, was, it was no scheme. That has a dollar sign for the S that you appeared in, Jimmy Fallon. You remember that? I, you know, I don't remember that because that was not what the movie was called when I filmed the movie. Was it Steam? Or was it. <laughs> I was in a film, my first film was called, yeah, The Scheme is what they ended up calling it. Yeah. That's very interesting. Uh, it, it's, it, it was really good if you can find it. <laughs> It, uh, it came out and uh, sank like the Titanic. It really did. Uh. Oh, well, they should have used U571 to go get it. 
Uh, oh, uh, uh, maybe they'll use uh, Valkyrie. Is that a movie? <laughs> but he's Tom Cruise in a lot of movies. He is. And he's, the, on the back uh, lot of Universal, they have a big, uh, a big thing that you can drive through. Right. That's right. It was. I've been there on that tour, uh, the Wicker Man tour. <laughs> <That's not true. laughs> I was speaking of War of the Worlds, but yes, Wicker Man tour was the one. Yes. Uh, but oh. uh, it's, it's like all space stuff. Something you would see in the movie The X Files, maybe. I don't know. The movie. You mean me. Fight the Future? X Files Fight the Future? That's correct. Is that okay. what it's called? I, I don't know. The, strand, the Spanish translation is E2 Mama Tambien. We're not uh, done. Well, you left your mark like the mark of Zorro. That's the oh. great Joe McHale. Crime Scene Kitchen. Crime Scene Kitchen premieres May 26th at 9 p.m. You're so fun. Hey.